Red uh, is a play by John Logan about Mark Rothko. Centers around a two year period that Mark Rothko was devoted to a series of paintings, a series of murals that would be hanging at the Four Seasons restaurant in the Seaton building. And the commission was by Philip Johnson himself, who was the architect for the Seagram's building in, 19, in the late 1950s. It was probably, arguably, the most uh, expensive commission uh, at that time for any single artist, $35,000, which today is worth two and a half million dollars. And so, it deals with Rothko's struggle of art versus commerce. He was very much a purist. And yes, he took the money, but he did struggle with taking the money to do the work. For an actor, having the opportunity to play an artist, and an artist recognized as uh, one of America's great artists of the 20th century uh, is a privilege, a challenge, um, something that uh, when, it was, when I was asked to do it, I immediately said yes to it. And um, to me, being an artist myself, as an actor, you want to take roles that are beyond who you are personally, or your own personality. And taking the role of Mark Rothko, a great painter, one who is known for known for huge personality, uh, his huge personality, as well as his great artistic talent. You want to, as an actor, be able to crawl into the skin of this character, and he's got so many wonderful attributes as well as so many um, great things about his life and in this period of this play that it covers, that it's just, it's just rich with great possibilities. So wonderful about having the opportunity to play Mark Rothko and be so close to one of his paintings. The relationship between Tennessee Rep and Rep Aloud and the Frisk Museum giving us the opportunity to have this collaboration of not only the spoken word, the written word, but also the art form of Rothko, uh, and so the artist himself, and having, having uh, an example of his work here in the Phillips Collection. And that when the audience comes to see the play, the stage reading of the play, um, performances, they then can come into the museum and experience Rothko, shall we say, in the flesh, or on the canvas, and, and within the frame, and, and uh, the juxtaposition of, of Rothko along with the other great uh, examples of the art here in the Phillips Collection is, you know, is, is so exciting that two art forms are going to be juxtaposed with each other that will, I hope, inspire people, um, challenge people uh, to, to think how important art is in their life, all art forms. And here is a beautiful um, opportunity for two art forms to celebrate each other.